So most people's home defense plan just boils down to basically defending with a gun and whatever security system they put in place that has a little sign out front in your bushes, in front of your house, you know? So what? The bad guys come through that and then you're just shooting, guns a-blazing? That's your plan? Really? No, you really need to... Get, you really need to pay attention now and understand that defense is so much more. The more layers you have, the better your chances of surviving that situation and defending your home. Now, everybody's home's different. Like I said earlier, if you're in an apartment, you're out in a rural area in a ranch, or you have a regular you know, suburban home. So you have a lot of things to think about when you're planning your home defense now. And we're gonna give you the framework for that. It's all principle-based. Gonna cover the five Ds, but that all, again, goes back to your skill set, your needs, your budget, and there's a lot of ways to get around things. Like if you're not into firearms, and I know there's people out there that aren't, there's a lot of ways you can defend yourself, defend your home, both passive and active, that you can employ. So home defense, you know, I was in the military, a lot of people use acronyms, it's been adopted, so it's easy to remember. And when you're saying the five Ds, you know, it's very simple. The five Ds of defense are deter, detect, deny, delay, and defend. And if I had to add a sixth one, it'd be ditch. Remember that back to your emergency planning. So it's kind of like pace, but these are the different circles and layers that'll get you to what you need in your home defense plan. You're right, you're gonna be in the middle, you're gonna have certain circles all the way out. And that's where the bad guys come in on that most outer circle. So when you're speaking deter, it's better to keep them from even getting into any of your circles. Then the next one would be detect. Any way that you can get an early warning that they're coming. Then it's deny. Any way you can keep them out physically. And then you want delaying factors, if that's like perhaps running to your safe room. And then it's defend at all costs. And that's when this comes in. 